Farmers in eight northeast Arkansas counties will grow the biomass crop Miscanthus as part of a federal renewable energy project. MFA Oil Biomass of Columbia, Missouri is joining with the U.S. Department of Agriculture in offering incentives for farmers in northeast Arkansas to grow Miscanthus, a sterile hybrid warm season grass as part of a federal effort to establish commercial scale dedicated energy crops. Select producers will receive up to 75% of the cost of establishing the perennial crop through USDA's Biomass Crop Assistance Program, or BCAP. So that enables the farmer to be a part of getting this crop in. It also takes specialty equipment, MFA oil biomass, is going to provide the planters and the harvesters to, uh, to establish the crop. And so as a result of that USDA program, uh, more than 6,500 acres will be planted here in eight counties in northeast Arkansas. Tim Wooldridge says some 70 farmers in the eight counties have signed up to grow miscanthus. The long-term goal is to eventually grow 50,000 acres. A search is underway to identify the site of a conversion facility that will potentially create several hundred new jobs. Our company is, is, uh, is actively now working with our Arkansas Economic Development uh, Commission and with local chambers of commerce, and they're, and they're looking at various facilities now, and uh, I think that they'll probably make a determination within the next few months, and we want to continue to advocate to the USDA the need for ongoing biomass crop assistance funding, BCAP funding, so that more farmers can take advantage of this exciting new crop. Miscanthus can grow as tall as 10 to 12 feet over a period of four years. It's like bamboo as it has a thick stalk, is not invasive, and can be grown on marginal ground, which there is an abundance of in the Crowley's Ridge region. Ultimately, growers may make 200 to $250 per acre net profit because their production costs are nominal. Arkansas State University professor Steve Green says miscanthus has a production advantage over similar crops like switchgrass. We look at it and we're harvesting above ground biomass to process into pellets or into liquid fuel and we estimate we can, we can get 10 to 12 tons per acre of biomass from a miscanthus crop. Switchgrass on the other hand, we're looking more at 5 to 8 tons per acre for switchgrass. Miscanthus is also environmentally friendly as it has a prolific root system where it stores nutrients that are reused year after year. The big issue has always been we're not going to build a facility to process it until we have the feedstock supply. Farmers are not going to grow a feedstock supply unless they have a place to, to sell their product. We've been in this cycle for years. Nobody's making a move. MFA oil has moved. We've got a, a company who is coming into Northeast Arkansas and saying, we're going to make it happen. Now, farmers are interested. Green says ASU is committed to working with farmers in developing a research program that will enable them to produce a viable miscanthus crop in Arkansas. 